If you enjoy this video by the end, make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe and hit the bell to get notifications for when I upload videos. And also, if you're feeling super generous, I have a link to my Patreon in the description down below. Regardless, thank you for watching and let's cue the intro. Hello everyone, it's your favourite queen, Android18 here, and today I'm going to be doing another Dragon Ball discussion. This is going to be talking about the um, Super Saiyan God form, specifically the red-haired one, which is the original, not the Super Saiyan Blue, which is the basically Super Saiyan version of the Super Saiyan God transformation. Yeah, so the Super Saiyan God, the original one, the red one, is basically an upgraded base form for Goku originally in the Battle of Gods movie and during the Dragon Ball Super series. And originally, in the anime at least, we only see this once, like for, for a very long time. Originally when Goku attains a transformation by holding hands with all the Saiyans, obviously, and then he gains the form and fights Beerus with it and gives him a pretty impressive fight. However, after this, it's kind of strange. This video's topic is basically going to be how the original Super Saiyan God form was extremely underused. And I'm going to explain why I think this and a lot of other people think this in the community. Basically, Super Saiyan God was extremely powerful and although Super Saiyan Blue was basically like the original Super Saiyan where it added a multiplier to the original form, for example, if it stays exactly the same as the original Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan Blue should technically be 50 times stronger than the original Super Saiyan God form. However, like Super Saiyan, it takes up a lot of um, the user's stamina. And unlike with the original Super Saiyan form where Goku and Gohan and Vegeta learned to control it fully so it didn't really drain their energy like it did when they first originally learned it, I don't believe Goku or Vegeta really learned how to fully master the red form in that respect where they could still maintain it obviously but I still think it took quite a bit of their energy. However, what doesn't really make sense in Dragon Ball Super is throughout the tournament arcs, and especially the tournament of power, they use Super Saiyan Blue a lot more than the original Super Saiyan God. And although I know the Super Saiyan Blue is more powerful than the original, it takes up a lot more stamina, and the whole tournament of power was all about conserving stamina, supposedly. So it's kind of strange. And we do actually see the Super Saiyan, you know, original Super Saiyan God form, the red hair return, in the tournament of power in the anime and it was really nice to see it because in my opinion that form feels a lot more special than super saiyan blue because it's used a lot more sparingly in the manga however the super saiyan god the red hair is used a lot more in the manga and is kind of used i think nearly as much as super saiyan blue so it's a lot more interesting to see that it's been used a lot more in the manga and taro taro the guy who does the dragon ball super manga he seems to know that um a lot of people like the the super saiyan god form and that um it's actually kind of more practical at times than super saiyan blue for example if goku and vegeta are in the tournament of power or during a tournament like the universe 7 versus 8 tournament arc if they're like fighting other opponents which aren't incredibly powerful they can switch to super saiyan red god and basically use less stamina and still win but i find it strange in the anime the way super saiyan god isn't used as much as super saiyan blue because a lot of the time they're talking about stamina and super saiyan blue has stated even in dragon ball super to take a lot more kind of goku and vegeta's energy rather than super saiyan god the original because it's just like if being in base form and being in super saiyan super saiyan drains more energy than being in base form so i find it interesting I hope I haven't confused any of you guys too much, but I just think it's extremely underused in the Dragon Ball Super anime because there are lots of situations where Super Saiyan Blue, um, not Super Saiyan Blue, Super Saiyan God could be used and they just use Super Saiyan Blue just cause and it doesn't really make that much sense. And I think it kind of took away a bit of the splendor that Super Saiyan Blue had originally. And it kind of made Super Saiyan Blue overused and the original Super Saiyan God underused. But what do you guys think about this? I kind of actually prefer the way Super Saiyan God, the original, looks. And I really love the fight between Goku and Beerus because um, it's a really special transformation. And I think it actually looks cooler than Super Saiyan Blue personally. Even though I do like Super Saiyan Blue, I just feel like it was a little overused by the end of Dragon Ball Super. At least with Dragon Ball Super, we got to see some of the older Super Saiyan forms, like 1, 2, and 3. And yeah, I'm not counting. <laughs> it's just what they're called. But yeah, anyway, if you enjoyed this 
little discussion make sure to hit the like button and i'm very curious to see what you guys think of this do you guys actually prefer super saiyan blue over the original super saiyan god i kind of prefer super saiyan god the original because when he first when goku first transformed into that form against beerus it just looked incredible especially in the movie and i really loved how impressive it was in its first showing and i just feel like although it, it being used more sparingly makes it a bit more special i just feel like it wasn't used enough in the series and there were times when goku and vegeta used blue instead of the original super saiyan god and i just found that a little strange like there are times where i was thinking in the series like why aren't you going to the original super saiyan god and save some stamina however the only one time i can justify goku like, not thinking and using Super Saiyan Blue, is when Roshi obviously basically dies, and then Goku needs to get out of the kind of me the liquid metal guy's hold, and he screams and turns into Super Saiyan Blue and breaks out. That's my favorite kind of use of, of Goku using Super Saiyan Blue without thinking, because that actually makes sense. But anyway, enough rambling from me. Comment down below what you think about this topic and let me know if you prefer Super Saiyan Blue or Super Saiyan God the Original. I'll, leave, I'll probably make a poll in this video so you can vote and just let me know what you think. Anyway, I hope you have a wonderful day and also don't forget everyone, subscribe to me because I'm definitely 18.